Now we're going to look at a simple multiplication table typically used by primary school. Okay, and um, what we're going to do here in this first column okay, is to fill in the one times table, which is simply 1, 2, 3, 4 until 12. Okay, so I'm going to type 1 in the first box, enter, it goes to the next box, type 2, enter. Okay, rather than type 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, out the way to 12, we're going to make use of Excel's drag and fill function. First, we select the boxes containing 1 and 2, and then we're going to drag and fill it down to the last entry, 12. Okay, so there we have the first column. Okay, so... Uh, let me just show you that again. So starting with just two numbers, we will generate down to 12. Next, for the two times table, okay, two, four, that's all. Okay, we are going to rely on Excel to generate 6, 8, 10, 12, and so on. By selecting the first two boxes containing 2 and 4, I'm going to mouse over the bottom right hold steady and double click and that gives you the two times table until 24 okay rather than continue for 3 4 and so on now that we have got the first two now comes in the neat trick I'm going to select the first two columns here the one times table and the two times table together these two rows Okay, and we're going to actually fill in the column for 3, 4, 5 until 12 using Excel's drag and fill. Okay, so selecting the two columns, mouse over the bottom right and click and hold and then we're going to drag it to the right. Amazing, and it fills up all the way. Okay, so from the first column and second column together, uh, let me show you that again. Just from the first two columns, mouse over, click and generate to the right. Okay, so this is how fast you can generate a multiplication table in Excel.